For Chris Beard and the Texas Tech basketball team, the last time each of them played Iowa State, the game had a much different feel. Gets it into Keenan, turns, shoots from Idaloo. It's good! With their backs against the wall and their NCAA tournament hopes bleak at best, Tech upset the ninth-ranked Cyclones at home, a game that propelled them to five straight wins and a run to the big dance. Texas Tech scores the biggest win of the Tubby Smith era. And a lot of people doubted this. So, you know, I, I think a lot of players, you know, felt that they had something to prove. But for Beard, his last meeting with Iowa State came when the Cyclones smashed Little Rock's Cinderella Slipper on the hardwood in Denver. The Clones sending his Trojans packing in the second round of their miracle run. It would have took the best 40 minutes we played this year, um, and we just didn't get it done. But now collectively, they meet again. For the Red Raiders, it's with the same edge they faced ISU with last season. After being picked seventh in this year's preseason poll, and overlooked once again in the Big 12 picture. I mean, if you're not, you know, here to play against the, the top people in the nation, I, mean, I think you're signed up for the wrong thing. No, we don't think we're better than anybody else. We, we understand how difficult this is going to be, um, but we also, we welcome the challenge. And if they want respect, they know what they got to go do, win. And as much as they might use that seventh place prediction as fuel for their fire, the parity is real. Each team in the conference so far this season has either been ranked or received votes in a top 25 poll, including six alone this week. For Red Raider Nation, I'm Andrew Doak.